Hi guys, I'm Scott with Dakota Safe Company in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Thank you for taking a few moments to watch our informational videos on our safes. Uh, today I'd like to go over some of the features of the Dakota Safe door and what to look for when purchasing a safe. One of the first things that you're going to notice on the Dakota Safe door is inch and a half solid steel locking bolts on a four-way active bolt design. What this does is it locks all sides of the door back in behind the frame, making for a more secure, more pry resistant door. Also, we put in pry tabs. In the four corners of the door, we have incorporated pry tabs that will fold back into the door, locking the bolt works in from being able to be pried in a pry attack. Another interesting feature on the Dakota safe is our hardened steel plate in front of the lock and relocker pin. This is not a little eighth inch plate. This is a full 3 8 hardened steel to Rockwell 60 or greater plate that will chew up a drill bit if somebody's trying to drill into your safe. Another feature that we have on the Dakota safes are our slip clutch design. A slip clutch design allows somebody to attack the outside of the handles without hurting or breaking the inner mechanism. If somebody were to try to force this handle, it will pop out of gear without putting undue pressure on the lock and the bolt work mechanism. To pop it back in, you simply keep turning it around until it locks back in, and you still have a fully functioning safe. Probably the most important feature on the Dakota Safe line of products is the full inner steel plate on the door. We like to call this our true composite door. In the market today, most safes are what's called a roll form, and I'll get to that and I'll show you what those, that means here in a second. A roll form door starts right here, folds up, comes over, comes down, but it's still just a single layer of steel. Dakota safes use two full steel panels inside the door, clamshelled around the insulation material to give it a completely rigid, pry-resistant door. Now I'd like to show you the Black Diamond by Dakota Safe Company. This is Dakota's little brother. Many of the same features that are found in the Dakota Safe are found in the Black Diamond Safe, just a little more economically priced. One of the things you'll notice, still have the inch and a half solid steel locking pins, still have the pry tabs for the pry resistant, still has the heavy 3 8 hardened steel plate protecting the lock and relockers, still has four-way bolt works, but only three sides are active. We use dead bolts on the back side on the Black Diamond safe. Also, the big thing that you'll notice, it is what's called a roll form door. It has the full layer of steel all the way around, with a stiffener plate. Now, that being said, we use a larger, heavier stiffener plate than most safes on the market, still giving that door quite a bit of rigidity. You are not going to bend or peel this door with hand tools. And now I'd like to show you what to watch out for when purchasing a gun safe as compared to the Dakota and Black Diamond products. One inch pins, roll form door, small stiffener plate, light steel. Always, always test your door for rigidity. Rigidity in your door is most of the security and fire resistance in your safe. Thank you for watching our video. I hope this helps you to make a more informed decision when purchasing your next gun safe. And of course, I recommend Dakota safes. Thanks y'all. Have a great day.